For us as Vodacom, it's always a pleasure to host visiting teams of, of MBA graduates who are not only interested in the subject matter, but also to understand the operating environment within which we find ourselves in. And I think based in South Africa with operations on the continent, this is really an opportunity for us to give a view of some of the operating challenges but also the opportunities more than anything. To be able to share this view um, with visiting students is always a pleasure. The questions are always um, very thought-provoking and allow us to tell the story of operating in emerging markets. Not only the program that you undertook for that two weeks, but what impressed me more is the long-standing collaboration um, that you have with South Africa and that this program is actually an extension of that collaboration. And, um, I think there's a lot to be learned between uh, Switzerland and South Africa in, uh, with these kind of programs and I think it's very beneficial not only to the students of Switzerland but also from South Africa. And from my perspective, um, the, as the Science and Technology Councillor, we can build on these collaborative um, activities undertaken from a bottom-up approach by Swiss universities and enlarge it to other programs. Uh, for me, this is a case study of excellence that I use to pro uh, for promotion of science and technology between Switzerland and South Africa. Visits have been, I think, very good for us uh, to interact with the students over the last, I think it's now, the, this is the third time, so we've, uh, we've, we enjoy sharing uh, the story of what we're trying to achieve and uh, understanding that, you know, we live in a global world, so it's, it's always encouraging to, to hear the questions and, and to hear the comments from, from the students. So it's, it's always a pleasure for us, for you guys to come here, so we really appreciate this. SAPI invests time and energy in these Master of Science visits because we believe that it's through sharing with the leaders of tomorrow um, our experiences, the realities of our company, the realities that we see in the global economy, that hopefully there will be some learnings, uh, some exposure to different realities, and that the students will be enriched by, by the experiences they get while they're here in South Africa. It was really enjoyable having a diverse group, people from different backgrounds, different um, focus areas. So I think the exposure that the group had here today and, in, and last year was, uh, I think, quite good, giving them an overview not just of, of telecom but of the industry as well as from uh, how we adopt the challenges that are unique to Africa and to, to South Africa. I was on a similar program myself uh, a few years back and um, the first thing I noticed was how widening of the periphery um, your business view gets widened by actually seeing best practices in other countries and engaging with different businesses. I would like to say thank you to the Fachhochschule Nordwest and to Professor Knut Hinkelmann. It's already the third time they are coming, which shows the interest and I think it's a very, very good thing for the students that they can do this. I look forward to the next visit and the next batch of students that will challenge us with some of the questions, but also allow us to tell the story of operating emerging markets to a wider audience. So we look forward to it. Thank you. So we really enjoyed the group here and we hope to see them in the future again. And thank you. Uh, hoping to be seeing you soon again. Thank you.